What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Dustin with Jersey Shore Drainage Solutions and today I'm going to show you how to prevent your yard from flooding by renting out your downspouts and sump pump lines. So let's get right to it. Alright on the left side of the house over here I'm going to be tying in their sump pump which is behind the fence here and this downspout and taking them out to the street. As you can see where the sump pump is all going to go under, tie in, tie into here and then come out to the street to a pop-up. Same thing over here on the right side of the house. Right side of the house, we're going to have that downspout come straight through, pretty much straddle on top of the gas line, come out all the way down here to a pop out as well. I've already done the neighbor's yard over here, as you can see with the pop up and their recharge system in the back. Same with their other neighbor. So, this is the third house in a row. And got the mark out everywhere, as you can see. At least this time for this mark out look they put the extra cable line in which was that hidden cable line i found here but when i had a mark out for here when i was over here they didn't have it so it's good to know that uh it's going to be there and i already know it's going to be there since i found it on the other house so let's get started and here we go everything is dug out completely now i'm starting to put pipe in make sure i got my grade Make sure I have enough down a little slope from the sump pump line after it's hooked up. So I have to put everything in first and then dry fit the pump line to make sure it's exactly how I want before I fully actually glue it in. Now to get piping. All right, and here we go. Front left is done. We have the end where the downspout is. All burrito wrapped up with the rock around it. Made it a little mini dry well, so that way when all the water no longer has any pressure from it raining or from the sump pump, then it can drain back into the ground. So as you can see, we have this all set up like this. It's tied into the back of it. Starting from back here where the sump pump is, I had to make it come over in 45 going that way because it was so much further down. But as you can see, we're completely downhill, so that way when there's no more actual water coming out and the pressure, it'll just gradually be able to go down towards the street, towards the end, so that way no water will be sitting in the pipe. And then we even have it down to the level in here, behind it, and then everything hits the downspout. So when it's raining, and as you can see, everything is glued, you'll see behind it, Right at the downspout, everything is completely downhill. So as soon as all the water hits right here to this corner and anything when it's raining, the water's gonna shoot down drastically all the way to the street. And as you can see right before we go into the sidewalk, we are still extremely downhill to the level. So that way we'll have no problems at all. The water will rush really fast all the way to the end. Now, the backfill Start on the other side and show you how this one works. All right, now we have the front right side of the house done. We've already done the left side, backfilled and everything. Everything's under the sidewalk, under the sprinkler lines. Now, time to pipe. Show you how everything looks. And here we go. Now we have it all run out. Everything is complete. We have the pop-up one. As you see down here at the end, we are down to the level. I have the bottom has got the rock as a mini dry well. I'm going to burrito wrap everything over it. We have the sprinkler line down the side for now. We have everything running downhill extremely. We're just picking up this one downspout on this side. As you can see from the level right here, everything is nice downhill level. Water's gonna come out, rush, go to the pop-up buildup, overflow onto the street and facilitate down to the nearest storm drain. Now, time to backfill and show you how it works. And this is how you show how your system works. After everything's done, put the hose in the clean out. And the water will come all the way to the end. Water pops up, builds up, facilitates down, and we'll go all the way down to the nearest storm drain down the street. That is exactly how you prevent your yard from flooding by running out your downspouts. Another job well done by Jersey Shore Drainage Solutions. As always, like, share, camera, subscribe, and until the next one.